Tezal Kathmandu. Nepal, the land of the Buddha and home to the world's highest mountain, really is a very unique location for taking a Tezal course. The TEFL International Tezal course in Nepal is located in its capital city, Kathmandu. With an approximate populace of around half a million inhabitants, Kathmandu is Nepal's largest and best-known city, a cosmopolitan meeting place of many diverse ethnic groups. Kathmandu is well known as a trade center, and for many years it controlled the most important trade route between Tibet and India. When you consider this along with the great many man-made and natural attractions of Nepal, it's hardly surprising that the charming city of Kathmandu has become a popular place for tourists to visit and also a popular location for taking a Tezal course. Situated along the world-famous Himalayan mountain range, Nepal is indeed a mystical place known for its friendly people, temples and unique natural geography. Nepal's landscape is tremendous, including some of the best walking trails in the world. From the natural and amazing beauty of the Himalayas to the national parks, the ancient temples and pagodas to the lively markets, street traders, and clubs and bars of Kathmandu Nepal really offers something for virtually everyone, and memories gained during a Tezal course in Nepal will linger for a lifetime. For many visitors one visit to this beautiful country is simply not enough. 8 out of 10 of the world's highest mountains are located in Nepal, including the highest mountain in the world, Mount Everest, at 8850 meters. You can really say that Nepal is the top of the world. There is a huge range of activities for your free time in Nepal including kayaking, whitewater rafting, mountain biking, climbing, or trekking in the parks or mountains. Visit some of the many Buddhist and Hindu temples. For a spectacular, yet different view of the Himalayas, take a short plane tour. You can also visit a typical Nepalese village, spend time and speak the villagers, have lunch and dinner, spend the night in a traditional village home, and then visit a school the following day. Visit Peyton, where you can wander the streets and come across some of Peyton's 600 stupas and 185 files, Buddhist monasteries, watch handicrafts being made, visit Durbar Square, the Royal Palace, Peyton Museum and the Zoo. Walk around the old city, shop at the many markets for local handicrafts, visit the Royal Palace or the National Museum or one of the many temples. For those looking for more lively activities, there is a wide variety of restaurants, bars and clubs. After all that exertion, take a relaxing yoga or meditation class or learn about Tibetan Buddhism 